Well, we're the efficiency leader. That's kind of our, our positioning and our focus. And uh, so our panels make more power for a given area than anybody else's panels. A little bit more than that, we have a 22% minimum. We have cells in the laboratory, which will be coming out, which are over 23%. You don't have, this is a conventional cell, you don't have these grids on the front of the cell that are sort of blocking some of the light going in. So a sun power cell is pretty much all black um, on the front. I had been researching solar cells at Stanford for over 10 years at that point. So we had this sort of jewel-like uh, technology that was used, for example, for powering solar-powered airplanes when you needed the highest performance. Uh, the fruits of our work were uh, ready to go out in the commercial world. Most of the obstacles were um, related to uh, trying to align the product with the market. Our initial uh, idea of doing concentrators, uh, attractive as it was on paper, just did not uh, materialize in the market. So we kept the company alive by doing special projects like making the solar cells for NASA. We realized that the industry was headed towards uh, flat panels as being the way to go rather than concentrators. On the other hand, uh, large existing players in the industry were generally major oil companies, Arco, Solar, Shell, uh, Solar, BP, and uh, it didn't look like a startup could really shoehorn into that. So we were kind of looking enviously upon the in industry uh, saying, gee, it'd be nice if we could raise $150 million to build a factory to see if we could compete, but nobody was going to give us $150 million until we met up with Cypress. So everything at SunPower changed at that point. I sort of think of SunPower in terms of BC before Cypress and, <laughs> and AC after Cypress uh, in terms of uh, we really got the scent at that point. We found the a company that believed in us and uh, eventually take us public. Prior to SunPower going public, most of Wall Street thought PV was not suited to a public offering. I think it kind of caught them by surprise. And when SunPower went public and it was so well received, essentially opened the, uh, the public markets to uh, a lot of companies. And, and that has dramatically changed our industry. You know. Within a couple of years of introducing our product in, in uh, California, we were number one in the market. Energy is a, a rather slow-moving uh, sector compared to what many technologists are, worth, are, are used to, such as IT or something like that. Well, solar is particularly difficult because the panel has to not only be very inexpensive, to make because sunlight is fairly diffuse source of energy, but it has to last 20 years or more, which is unusual for a product, and it has to do that outdoors, which is very unusual. So uh, it's a tall order and it takes, um, frankly, just a lot of work. Our R&D group is continually working on ways to improve the efficiency uh, as we go forward and keep, keep that leadership. We encourage our engineers to uh, innovate and file patents and, and uh, you know, we, we do all this sort of things that you would read about a big comp a bigger company doing to uh, foster innovation um, and uh, just hope we're successful at doing that.